what your parents were in business or your parents were employed what are some of the influences your parents had on you so my my dad for a very long time mm -hmm. uh he was he, by profession mm -hmm. an accountant mm -hmm. but he rose up um and had a very has a still mm -hmm. a very successful career mm -hmm. so at, at a very young age yeah. my my dad used to work in different places and mm -hmm. towns in nairobi mm -hmm. i mean in kenya mm -hmm. uh, and a lot of times was the project mm -hmm. manager mm -hmm heading various projects so mm. when we'd go visit mm. i always knew my dad is the boss mm. i was i always had that mentality mm. and watching him mm -hmm. learning what it is to be a boss mm -hmm. uh, and so I, it just became a part of me and yeah. a lot of the things the projects would have was to help entrepreneurs mm -hmm. so i also took up entrepreneurship mm. at a very young age mm -hmm. uh, my first business when i was five years mm. old uh, and i remember even the first business what are you doing at five years so interesting story. <laughs> I ruined Christmas. Uh -huh. uh, so my my we go to church in Shags, mm -hmm. uh, up country, yeah. and up country to raise money. Sometimes, or when people want to give the church offering mm -hmm. and tithe, mm -hmm. you bring if you don't have cash, you mm -hmm. bring in whatever uh, you have in your farm. Yeah. So someone brought in a goat. My dad bought the goat mm -hmm. for the Christmas celebration. Mm -hmm. So as we are driving home, I tell my dad, Dad, mm -hmm. is this goat female or male? Mm -hmm. So I can't remember, I think it was male. So I said, yeah. why don't we buy a female goat mm. and then mm. the, we make sure they get kids, mm. we sell their kids mm. and then I will make money, then we can eat the yeah. goat later, but we make money <laughs> after, out of it. After it's good, I was but, yeah. joking. When we got home, yeah. I refused for that goat to, to be, be slaughtered. slaughtered. Yeah. They had to go to their butchery mm. and just buy goat meat. Yeah. And then that goat, they got me a partner for the goat, uh -huh. and my small goat business mm. started, and I would get a report every month. Oh. And so growing up, as mm. I was always the cool kid mm -hmm. because I always had money. We uh, had a farm yeah. at the river. Mm. I would go get products, mm. sit by the roadside, mm. and sell. And then I realized that money is good because... Uh -huh. So you used to sell employed. the goods? Yes. I used to sell goods. We used to have like even onions, tomatoes. Mm. I sell them mm. and I realized the money is good because mm. it would make me the boss. And the small errands my mom would give me and small jobs, mm. instead of doing them, I would pay my sisters to do it for me. And even people <laughs> around me, I used to pay them do this for me. My mom tells me, do this house job, I pay people. And then I would make sure as a kid, I have the coolest rulers mm. uh, and pencils. In the mathematical yeah, sense. I used to share with people <laughs> with mine and yeah. even rent it out for mm. a favor. Mm -hmm. You do something for me, I'll give you. Mm. So I quickly learned money and power mm. at a very um, young age and until today I still enjoy money and making power. money and having <laughs> <laughs> That's very interesting. I, yeah. I love it and yeah. I enjoy it. 